you are listening to Sinu Podcast. This program is a collaboration between the Kapurei Communication and Alumni Relations Center and the Language Institute. Hello, everyone. This is Ashley Sumung, and welcome back to another episode of Sinu Podcast. And today, new is. From local to premium, seem you racist to bar to promote creative tourism. So let's hear the name from Mr. Clayton Chatterworth. Thank you, Ashley. Food has been a significant factor in the growth of creative tourism, and local dishes have been used to attract tourists because of their distinctive appearance, flavors, and ingredients. However, for many, dishes still lack a wow factor. So Chiangmai University has come up with an idea to transform local dishes into delicious premium ones using the art of food decoration. The Tai Lu community in Ban Luang Nua village in Doi Saket district of Chiang Mai was selected as the model community because of its distinctive food culture. This value-adding initiative is in line with the Ministry of Higher Education, Science, Research, and Innovations project. On creative industry development to drive the local economy in collaboration with the Department of Industry Promotion, Ministry of Industry, the Center of Tourism Research and Development at CMU, and Assistant Professor Dr. Patwara Patomrang Siangkun, Assistant Dean of the Faculty of Agro Industry, led a team of volunteer students from the Faculty of Agro Industry, the Faculty of Engineering, and the College of Arts, Media, and Technology, or CAMP, to the model community in Luang Nua. The project, titled "Youth for the Nation: Creative Local Tourism Potential Development in Luang Nua Subdistrict, Doi Saket District, Chiang Mai," aimed to host activities to develop technology and food management skills among local entrepreneurs. A chef from the Blackage Artisan Kitchen, a chef's table-style restaurant, was invited to share tips for food decoration to create a perfect combination of aesthetic and local flavor. That adds values to local menus, enhancing the image of the local tourism industry. Moreover, locals receive training in technology such as computer software, mobile applications, and social media for promoting local dishes to try from participating students who also contributed to the administration of the local business plan, training, and tourism promotion videos, which was a unique opportunity for them to get hands-on experience. The purpose of this project was to foster strong marketing skills and the incorporation of technology and innovation in cultural capital to drive the Creative Industry Village initiative. CMU recognizes the importance of field engagement to the development of the local food industry, along with the community itself. Through publicity of local food identity and awareness of the values of the local culture and wisdom among tourists, commercial success can be attained, leading to sustainable growth and tourism management. Thank you very much, and that's it for today. Please stay tuned to the next episode of Seeing You Podcast on YouTube and Facebook, and don't forget to follow the hashtag Seeing You Podcast. Until next time, thank you and goodbye.